Here we're at Banbury Hall and Gardens, a historical tourism site in York. Like many other sites which is founded by National Trust in England, Banbury Hall and Gardens benefits a lot from the volunteers. At the same time, volunteers also find their satisfactions here. In today's program, we will explore those stories behind the hall and gardens. We have different people on every day who will come and work in the house. They're quite often retired people, although we do have younger people as well. The, the trust really couldn't manage without them. They're, real, they're their main, one of the main stays of, of the trust. The process of recruiting a volunteer is, is varied. Um, there are open days on uh, Benningborough here. We do advertise constantly for uh, new volunteers to arrive. Yeah, so the more the merrier. Although there are about 200 volunteers who keep the site operates well, Benningborough Hall and Gardens still need more volunteers. There is a problem with volunteers shortages, but there could be. Uh, but They've got to manage their, they've got to advertise, they've got to make sure that people know that they're welcome to come and do things. And maybe that is a weakness in the organisation. If we don't have the volunteers to begin with, then this place wouldn't run. Recruiting new volunteers is difficult. People are not sure if they are qualified enough to get this job and what they will get from volunteering work. It often attracts people who really enjoy talking to other members of the public, who like telling stories, who like giving out information, who are pleasant with people, uh, know how to be friendly with, with children. Um, it's, a, it's a really cross-section. And you can completely re-learn things uh, in, in your mindset and do something completely different. The visitors also have their personal views of volunteering. If there weren't helpers we wouldn't see all this yeah. Not in its beauty. beauty. Uh, I would like to be but I think now probably too old. I mean you couldn't operate without them. I mean uh, uh, you, you need them, the stuff of the National Trust. <laughs> My answer would probably be no because I don't have enough time. Um, I probably need a volunteer to come and help me, actually. Yeah, it'd be quite nice, yes. Yeah. I'd help with the fish over there. Yeah. <laughs> How about you? Yeah. The promoting and marketing campaigns for recruiting more volunteers should never be stopped. Bennyware Hall and Gardens also encourage young people to get involved.